Hey guys, J-Man here. Okay, uh, I'm bored. So I thought, let's do a video. What kind of video am I gonna do? Fantastic Four, yes, okay. So as you know, I've been reviewing the Fantastic Four current series as well as the Kirby Lee uh, original stuff. Um, I'm really liking this new Fantastic Four. I've only read the first nine, I think. I'm on number 10. I haven't read it yet, but I was like, you know what? I, I gotta get these. I gotta get these physical. And you know I don't really get physical comics. So I went to my comic shop. And um, there's a comic shop next to where I work. Um, it's called Conspiracy Comics. It's in Burlington, Ontario, Canada. And um, I was able to get lots. And then I went to um, Gotham Central which is in Mississauga. Now, um, they're a like, great comic shop. Um, they're close to where I live. So those are the kind of the two that I normally hit. And then there's actually one that's close to my escape room, um, which is called Comics Connection. So I might actually go there because I didn't get everything. But I thought I'd just show you quickly what I got. There it is. Fantastic Four number one. I think I already had this. I think I bought this when it came out, and then I just... Uh, filed it somewhere but I couldn't find it so I thought what the heck I'll buy a new one. First printing of number one. Very cool. Uh, first printing of number two. First printing of number two. First printing of number three. These were all like, these were all like conspiracy comics. Um, here's one number four first printing. This I had to get at um, Gotham and it, it was it was a five dollar tag as opposed to a four dollar um, so there's that now and I got number five this is the big one the wedding so I've reviewed this already really really great stuff number six that, that was the first printing number six first printing all right number uh, seven first printing now you can always tell um, the printing by the last two numbers on the on the code there so um, like for example I'll get to one where there's like a variant. If it's a one and a one, that's the the cover and the printing. So this is like cover one, printing one. All right. I'm not sure how many people knew that. That that's just like a random random fact. All right. So there's number eight. First printing, War of the Realms tie-in. Uh, number nine. So that's a first printing as well. Original cover or cover A or one. Number 10, so I'm about to read this one. This is the next one I'm gonna read. Okay, number, uh, yeah, or 10, yeah, number 11. So again, that's the first, first printing. Basically everything I have is first printing. Number 12, Thing versus Hulk. Haven't seen that before. Um, number 13. That was exactly like that. Okay. Uh, number 14. So I haven't seen, I haven't read any of these yet, right? Pretty cool. Just admiring, I like the cover of this one here. 15. I'm liking this cover. This looks very like sci-fi. I like this Fantastic Four flag. First printing, first cover. We're definitely get. there's a variant in here somewhere. Um, okay, number 16. I like that too. Here we go. Here's a variant. So this is number 17. Okay, so this is number two, like the second one, and uh, first printing. I didn't have a, much choice on this one. I had to get this one. So I might try to note down to get the regular cover as well, just because um, I'm missing number 18. So that is where I have to go check uh, Comics Connection. I'm going to probably check Monday. Um, and I got number 19. That's just the current issue right there. And that's a first first printing of the first of the original cover. Okay, but I didn't stop there. Once, like, look, we're comic fans, right? Once you go to the comic store and you buy one comic, you're like, I already bought one. Let's buy two. Let's buy three. Let's buy four. Let's buy a lot. All right. Um, 
As you know, I've been uh, literally gushing over the X-Men Fantastic Four versus or crossover or whatever disagreement. Um, so I had to get... I missed out on getting this. That's a big time fail. So I got this one. This is a variant. Um, Kitty, one of my favorite characters, not dying over her in Marauders. But I kind of like her in every other... Anytime she appears in other X, Dawn of X books, I'm fine with her. I just don't like her in Marauders. I don't know. Anyway, um, this is a really nice cover. Really nice. Uh, this is so about number one. So this is a variant. This is the, the second cover, first printing. Beautiful, beautiful uh, artwork there. Um, and then I got number two. So that's the original cover, first printing. Um, you've got Emma and everybody on board here. <gasps> Oh, that's just the plastic. That's that's like genuine fear. You think like, oh no, this 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 comic's destroyed. It's fine though. Um, and why you know why limit yourself to Marvel when you can also get DC? Now this one I didn't get. Um, I got this one before. Um, I didn't get this one today. I had I got this one before. So that's just something that I, I still haven't put that away yet. Um, I already showed you guys in humans in a different video. Uh, I was missing some daredevils, so I got some daredevils that I missed. What else? Yeah, I was missing daredevil 10. I'm still missing a couple of, I'm missing daredevil 4 and 6. I don't know how I missed these things. It's just a fail on me. Um, Excalibur, I already talked about, so I can go over here. I got giant size number one. It's Emma, it's Jean. I mean, why why did I not buy this like instantaneously? I don't know. Um, this one was where it was mostly just art. Uh, it was all art. I liked it. Um, some people didn't like it. I saw some people talking about it in other uh, media and they're like saying that they didn't like it. I really liked it. So that's that. Um, while I'm here, I'll show you a couple of other things. Um, I'm gonna show you some of my Fantastic Four collection. Um, I don't have the original number ones of any of these, so I got this though. I was able to get these. Masterworks really love these covers. So I've got the first three volumes of that. Um, I've had these forever, for ages, but like, look at how beautiful they've... Now, I don't mind this remastering of these. Um, I don't like when they recolor it and, and draw it over again. Like, I think they're doing Giant Size X-Men. Giant Size X-Men is my favorite one comic book. If you just say pick one comic, not a, a string, uh, like not an arc or, or a trade or something. Just one. Love Giant Size X-Men. I, I don't own it. I probably never will unless I win the lottery. I did buy tickets. Okay. Um, if I win the lottery, I'm going to fucking buy Giant Size number one. How do you like that shit? depending on the price and how much I win, I suppose. Okay. Yeah. Um, so I've come up, I've come up with a mission. My mission in life is going to be not, not, not world peace, unfortunately, um, not to cure the coronavirus, uh, but it is to get all the fantastic four, uh, Jack Kirby and Stan Lee issues. Probably not going to get the first fucking 40 or something. <laughs> But I'm going to try. So to that end, I have started right here. This is it. This is the beginnings, people. Um, I have number 56 with Claw on the cover. I love Claw. He's so cool. The other ones I've already showed you in a previous video. <clears throat> but what the hell? It's Fantastic Four. Who doesn't like to see them all again? There you go. There's these ones, right? That was, uh, that was what was that? 77, 78... Showing them fast to you, 79. This is the piss condition one. I went through these <clears throat> um, a lot more detailed. That this is 80. 81, first appearance of my girl, Crystal. If I had a comic book girlfriend, it might be Crystal. Uh, probably Jean. Sorry. Sorry, Crystal. Um, 82. Oh my god, it's Black Bolt. <clears throat> 83. Condition garbage, but it's there. So yeah, that is the start of my Fantastic Four collection. And just to be a total nerd, um, I actually work in the offices of a box factory. Um, that's my day job. I know everyone thinks I run the escape room. That's kind of my evening job. Um, so I actually make 
boxes and we design boxes. So I do the quotes for them. Um, you don't need to know any of that stuff. But because we make our own boxes, I can do stuff like this, where I can create whatever template I create, we can cut out. So this is the lid to my blue Fantastic Four box, which is right here. It is a short box. I've got two of these made out of blue. I also have a red one made for my Daredevil collection. And that's it for colors. I thought there was gonna be, it sounded like, it sounded like there was gonna be more, but there's just those two colors, <laughs> red and blue. I can get any color if I can find, um, if I can find the corrugated board. If I can find the board for it, then I can get it cut out. Um, now, obviously this doesn't fit all my comics, but I, I, I use uh, the, so you know I've got the Funko Pops over here. So I use these guys, uh, these are actually duplicates. I use these to stand up, because you know, I hate when comics fall down. If you wanna piss me off, have your comics fall down. Pisses me right off. Um, plus I cry a little bit when that happens. Okay, so we're gonna put all these in. And that is it, that is the start. Oh, we're gonna add all this in right now. And we're gonna add these suckers in. We're adding all this into the box. And, nope. Oh, I've already gotta move some of the pops. Wow, that was fast. That was very fast. Us comic book guys know that once you start getting a bunch of these things, you just it just gets it goes really fast. You think it's not going to go as fast as it does, but then it goes super fast. Let me see, can I fit these guys back in? Oh, I can fit them in. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, I was able to fit them back the way that they were. Perfect. I'm gonna close that box up, and I'm gonna put Mr. Fantastic on top to guard it. If anyone comes near this box. Mr. Fantastic, well, he'll do nothing because he's just a toy. He won't, he, he won't do anything. But if someone's an idiot, they might think he's alive. Toy Soldiers was just on today. So maybe they'll think it's that. No, he will not stand. He won't stand. He's going to have to lay down on the job. That's it. I'm going to put these guys away. So yeah, totally random video talking about Fantastic Four. Yay. Uh, awesome. Cool. That's it, guys. Until next time.